Dana, this is one of the tracks we're the most proud of, what we've done out here in our group management. We really think the logger did a good job, and we really tried to protect the biological diversity. And, you know, the thing about the Southern Appalachians is the most biologically diverse forest in the Northern Hemisphere. And a lot of people don't realize that, Jim. I mean, I think that's one of the other things about that that is important part of the story that needs to be right. told is that the southern region is one of the most biologically diverse regions in the world. Exactly. And this forest that we're in right here is is it from us from the standpoint of number of species of trees and salamanders and other plants and animals. Yeah, on this track alone we cut not only yellow poplar but we cut northern red oak, white oak, uh, black cherry, hard maple, white ash, you know, a lot of very valuable northern hardwood species grew on this property right here. Is that part of why you try so hard to do things differently? Absolutely. The worst thing we can do is, to, is not take care of the land when we log it because we want to be able to come back and harvest on those tracks again someday in the future. Yeah. yeah. And I know it's been my experience, you know, as I've done this work now for 20 years working to protect forests and uh, in the midst of, you know, a region where, you know, this is ground zero in the southeastern region for industrial logging. Uh, you know, the southeastern region, there's four times the forest cover loss from logging than in the South American rainforest. A lot of people don't realize that either. But uh, one of the reasons why I think that, you know, pe people like you are so important is because it's been my experience that people in the forest people who are foresters, who are professional mm -hmm. foresters, uh, become c go to that profession because they really do have a connection and relationship to the forest. Absolutely. Um, and somewhere along the line that has gotten lost for many. And you represent what I think a lot of foresters would love to be able to do more of. Yeah, we're doing what we love to do. I mean, we want to take care of the land. You know, a good forester wants to do that. You know, forestry is an art and a science. Mm -hmm. You know, in many cases we've forgotten that, but we're trying to reestablish that, and FSC helps us do that. It's great that we've been able to connect because Columbia Forest Products and uh, your company is doing such a great job of showing an industry how to continue to improve Thank and you. how to really pay attention and seeing the forest for more than just the trees, but everything else that's here.